because I feel like I'm blending into my sofa. I've got my cosmic dress, my cosmic bomber jacket and my cosmic cover because can you guess I love the stars, I love space, I love stargazing and um, I love cosmic things so here I am and hopefully I'm not camouflaged. <laughs> Anyway, my name's Karen Kay, also known as the Fairy Lady, also known as the Mer Fairy because I love mermaids too. Actually, I love mermaids, fairies, unicorns, angels, and everything mystical and magical and beautiful in this world. <laughs> so I'm going to do a reading from Oracle of the Fairies and see what message the fairies have for us today. And I hope you're doing very well. I know that it's, wow, it's a very challenging time for everybody. We're all in the same boat. We're all navigating uncharted waters, but together it feels like we're navigating and we're all rowing in the same direction, which is wonderful. And the government in the UK have just announced that we've got another three weeks at least in lockdown. So really it's a time to go within as I always say if you can't go out go within but also explore those things that you've been wanting to do like creative projects singing learning an instrument painting drawing collage sewing knitting whatever it is just take some time to do that because it's very therapeutic and it can make you feel really good positive and energized fairies fairies can you offer us some insight and wisdom during these challenging times abundance oh that's beautiful now this can be it doesn't have to be financial abundance in fact it's probably not at this time because we're all kind of thinking about the financial side of life probably if you're in lockdown if you run a business if you have a job perhaps the financial side of life is playing a part in your daily thoughts concerns and possibly even worries but worrying never helps anything really you can use those thoughts to be constructive and think of constructive ways that you can manage your finances so that all of your needs are met, meaning that you have a roof over your head and food in your belly. Those are the main things that we need. And most of us, especially those of us who are watching this right now, have those things. So that is a huge blessing. We can also have an abundance of love. And we need that right now an abundance of universal and divine love, and especially if you're self-isolating on your own. With all this stuff going on, being on your own can be super challenging and a little bit scary or a lot scary. That's totally understandable and totally justifiable because nobody knows where this situation is going, but we do know that the self-isolation, this lockdown, especially in the UK, is working right now. So we need to continue this and find ways to navigate our way through this. And abundance has come into our cards today, which is a really beautiful, vibrant, energetic card. Abundance. Prepare yourself for incoming abundance. Release any mental blocks you may have. In fairyland and human land, there is enough abundance for everyone. Now, I really feel like this fairy is talking to us about an abundance of sustenance, of food, the things that we need. There's no need to panic buy anymore. I know everybody went crazy and started panic buying, but you don't need to do that because there is an abundance of everything. And it's about just taking what you need, no more, no less. Just take whatever it is that you need. You could look at growing your own seeds planting your own garden if you have one, or pots on a patio or even on a windowsill. You can grow plants anywhere. I grow lots of different things, including sprouts. I have alfalfa seeds, which are super easy to grow. You just put them in a pot or in a seed propagator and put water on them every day. And within three to four to five days, you will have fresh green sprouts. You know where they've come from. It's fresh food, it's raw food. And if you get organic seeds, it's organic food, which is super good for you. And you can put it on a rice cake with some hummus. 
and it's really, really healthy and it makes you feel extra special that you've grown it yourself as well. It's really good fun. So I urge you to try that because you can do that with your children if you have them as well. And you can watch them grow, watch the process and send the seeds love as they grow. It's such a fun thing to do. So there is an abundance and this fairy is coming in to say that there is an abundance for all of us. If we just open our hearts and our minds to receive the abundance that is all around. So receive the abundance, receive the abundance of love, receive the abundance of light and nourishment. There is an abundance of nourishment for our mind, body and soul. Be open to receiving this. Know that all is well and it will be even better as time goes on and we create the future within this present moment. So find that inner peace, find the calm within, and just surrender to life and the moment and know that all is well. I send you so much love, light, joy, and magical fairy blessings. Until the next time, take care. Do you believe in fairies? If they don't exist, nor do I.